people would often kind of look at me in quite a strange way. It's not normal that you try and create a high technology company that's farming millions of insects right in the heart of London. But insects are just nature's perfect upcycling machines that create organic natural protein that we can feed to animals and eventually make humans. I'm just like most people, I go and play football every weekend, I love to watch films. Travelling is one of my key like, loves, but with my own eyes I've seen the devastation that we cause. What people don't realise is there's a huge disconnect between what we eat and how we feed what we eat. All farm fish that we create are dependent upon wild caught fish to feed them. We feed fish to chickens. All animals need to eat fats and proteins to grow, just like we do. Now these proteins come from two sources traditionally, that's fish meal and soya protein. Now soya protein is one of the biggest causes of deforestation in the rainforest and fish meal means that we are dredging our oceans empty of small pelagic fish which are the base of the global food web. There's only so much rainforest we can cut down, there's only so much oceans that we can actually deplete until we get to a really dangerous pinch point. We have the dual forces of a growing population with an increasing demand for protein. There's a moment in your life where you just think enough is enough and you have to do something about it. So I started EnterCycle. We're using black soldier flies. They're a non-disease, non-pest, globalised species. Each female lays a thousand eggs, and in nature, 99.9% .9 of them will be eaten. However, we are able to conserve them and then utilise them into a full closed-looped uh, system. We feed the larvae on food waste, such as brewery grains and coffee waste, and they consume that and convert it into both protein to feed animals and fertilizers to grow more plants out of the same system. So actually we have to tackle not only the problem of deforestation and kind of emptying the oceans, we can also tackle food waste. The farmers of tomorrow are the engineers of today. We've created specialist chambers to look after the insects and their different life cycles. We can stack this four meters high and as many kilometers long as you like. We have automation systems that are modulated and run by themselves 24 hours a day, 365 days a year in any environmental condition and that's vitally important to feeding a growing population. A Western diet that we have been selling to developing countries the last 50 years is not about to go away overnight. Insects are becoming a trend. The Western diet has to kind of shift and change. And most importantly, it's natural, it's normal, and it's the way that we have to feed the future. We're facing big global challenges, and people don't believe that they can make a change, but you really, really can, because you making a change is the only change you can really make. But when it times is by nine billion people, it makes a fundamental difference to the way that we live in this planet. <laughs>